Hey guys, Chef Whitney here. Today we are making quick pickles. For today's recipe, you'll need the vegetables that you're pickling, fresh or dried herbs, white vinegar, kosher salt, water, and sugar. For the tools, you'll need a pot, a cutting board, a chef's knife, a peeler, measuring cups, measuring spoons, and containers to put your pickles in. Before we start preparing our veggies, we're gonna go ahead and make our pickling brine. For every pound of vegetables, you're gonna to wanna to do one cup of water, one cup of vinegar, you could do a white vinegar or a different type of vinegar, uh, one tablespoon of kosher salt, and one tablespoon of sugar. I'm making five batches, so I'm gonna put five cups of vinegar. Now I'm gonna add five cups of water. five tablespoons of salt, and five tablespoons of sugar. Now we're gonna take this to the stove and start heating it up. Let's turn on our stove. And we're gonna let this heat up until all of the sugar and salt has dissolved. The first type of pickle I'm making is just going to be a classic cucumber pickle. You can slice this however you want. I'm gonna slice mine into chips and then I'm just gonna put them straight into my container. The next type of pickle that I'm making is a hot carrot. I'm doing carrots and jalapenos. So before you cut your carrots, you will want to peel them. The last type of pickle I'll be making is pickled green beans with onion.
I have my three types of pickles. I have my classic cucumber, I have my hot carrots, and my green beans and onions. And now is when you can go ahead and add any fresh herbs or garlic or even dried seasonings as well. So I'm gonna add a little bit of garlic to all of my pickles. And you can use minced or whole cloves. I have some celery salt I'm gonna to add to my pickles. And a little bit of thyme. You just need about one or two sprigs total. And we'll do a little bit of rosemary. Now that we've built all of our pickles, we are going to add our pickling brine. Let's cover our pickles. Now that we've added all of the brine to our pickles, if you were canning your pickles, this would be the perfect time to do that. If not, and you're just leaving them in jars to put in your fridge, you're gonna wanna let these cool first before you put your lids on them and put them in your fridge. And there you have it. Delicious, easy, and three different types of quick pickles. Thanks guys for cooking with me. See you next time.